as a club, but every year I host these awards. Every year I'm privileged to host these awards. Every year it gets bigger. Every year it gets better. But it's not every year that one of our clubs plays on television in the FA Cup and holds their own against a club who've just been promoted to the championship. It's not every year that one of our clubs gets to Wembley and wins. So perhaps you special one this year, but one thing that doesn't change is the nominees for these awards. Now whether you win or lose, you are all heroes, because the whole point of these awards is to give recognition to people who wouldn't normally get it. Whether that's on the pitch or off the pitch, every single one of these 16, isn't it 16? 16 this year, fantastic to win, and everyone has been nominated, you deserve the recognition you're gonna get. So as Tom says, I'm gonna do the awards, we're gonna bring out the, uh, read out the shortlist, announce the winner, chat to the winner, but then, all of the runners up, you've all got a medal this year as well, and remember, come in front of here for your photos. So, should we get started? Right, so, the first of 16 of these awards is for Match Day Experience. And the shortlist of four is Burnham, Yateley United, Ascot United, and Hungerford Town. I've only got one hand here, you haven't thought about this, so you might have to open it for me. <laughs> this will only add to the suspense. And the winner of the Match Day Experience Award is... Burnham. Congratulations, first of all, that's giving you a trophy on the first there. In front of this. Right, come over here, come on, you're not getting away without an interview. Uh, names first of all, please. Okay, my name is Paul Butler, I'm the marketing and media director at uh, One Game Region on the Club uh, and, and this award, I mean, it, it's in terms of match day experience, you've got to think if the fans are the most important person, uh, the most important people at a club, this award is absolutely vital. What have you done to make you worthy of this award? Because you obviously deserve it. I think if you look at football as both a sport and entertainment, um, we look at Burn as a family, but also as like inviting people to your own home and that uh, we treat people. So uh, whether it's you know building up to a match day, what we do in terms of social media and you know even down to make sure there's blue rolls in the toilets, whatever, brushing the pitch, etc. Um, but then also making sure that you know they're glad that they've actually come to the Amy Centre Stadium on a match day, enjoyed the experience. I've got under the smile on the face whether they've won or uh, won lots of four. Do, do you actually hear the feedback from your fans? Do you know how much they appreciate it? Oh, absolutely. We do. We get feedback and for people from social media, people on match day, fans, uh, people from the dates, people from the team. Um, yeah, all sorts. The social media is really good. It's the um, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. Yeah, we get feedback all the time. If you look at the, the professional game, as high up as you go, sometimes the match day experience isn't great. Even at the very, very top, it's all about, oh, it doesn't matter. If they're winning, they'll come. If, if they're losing, they'll come because they support our club. But at this level, that is, actually isn't the case. So how important is it that people do come here and think, okay, well, actually, I can't remember if we lost last week, but I had a great day. Well, I'll answer your question, please. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there's two of you, you can hand it over. That's a bit of a carry on. I think with match day from, from the moment you drive your car or how long you get to the ground, you go through the gates, come into the car park, come into the ground, or into the bar, um, the, the club as a whole, it's a bit, a bit like the family. So you, um, it's, everyone's involved from the minute that person comes through that gate into the car park, and you're doing our bits to make sure that experience is pleasurable, enjoyable, and 
actually a great game of football. I hope you three points to go. Well, I'm actually a member of the Burnham Working Men's Club. I bet you didn't know that. The next time I'm there and there's a game on, I will go there, then come to you. But well done. Congratulations to Burnham.